demonstrate, we're going to do some electrical experiments with the minerals. We use an electrical demonstration because it shows the real power of the minerals. Minerals have different functions individually and collectively they are the conductors of this electrical energy in the body. This simple electrical device will show us just how well different types of minerals conduct electricity. We're plugged into an electrical outlet, but because we've cut one of the wires to create an open circuit, the electricity can't get through to light up the light. When there's enough minerals between the prongs, as when I touch this quarter, the circuit is closed and the light comes on. First, we'll dip the prongs into a small beaker full of distilled water. Because it is void of minerals, Distilled water will not conduct electricity, so the light remains dead. If you didn't have any minerals in your body, then you'd be dead just like this light. In fact, in this country, the clinical definition of death is when all electrical activity in the brain is gone. Maybe that's the reason there's so many people walking around half dead. But seriously, every thought and every action of the body requires electrical activity. This demonstration doesn't show us what specific minerals are present, but it does demonstrate the mineral's concentration, solubility, and ability to conduct electricity. Of course, to know what minerals are present in a product, read the label. Let's compare the common types of mineral products and see how they react electrically. Most companies attempt to get their trace minerals from mine sources, such as ancient seabed clay deposits, which are often high in aluminum, ancient organic or petrified sea vegetation, or of volcanic origin. This is a very easy way to make a mineral tablet. They simply grind up some of these rocks or petrified vegetation and call it a mineral tablet. You can run an analysis and indeed the minerals are there. The trouble is that most people have a difficult time assimilating these ground up rocks. You can test this type of mineral supplement by mixing it with water. You can leave most products in the water for months and the light still wouldn't come on. The minerals are there, but they're not very soluble and hence difficult to assimilate. I'm sure you're all familiar with herbs. Let's test some herb powder. Different herbs contain different minerals in different combinations, which give them their unique chemical properties, but they're all loaded with the soluble minerals. This is alfalfa powder, which has one of the highest concentration of soluble minerals. But you could use most any herb with similar results. There's enough minerals there that the light comes on. Now that we've seen that most products are obviously inferior, is there a superior product? One that can really give us all the usable, soluble minerals that our bodies are desperately crying for? Yes. Let me show you exactly what we're so excited about. It's called Constancy Trace Mineral Drops and is the base of every one of our high quality products. This is why my father became so excited 21 years ago and why people around the world are becoming more and more excited as they discover just how well it really works. Watch. There's one drop. Now that's pretty good, but is it good enough for someone like yourself? There's two, three, four, five. We suggest that a person use between 30 to 60 drops a day, which would be about like that. Now, wow, now there's enough minerals to really do you some good. Here's a couple of our tablets whole, and here's a couple crushed up. I'll demonstrate that our tablets are just as soluble as our liquid. We've discovered a way to absorb the liquid minerals into an herb base and retain the solubility of the minerals, which causes a synergistic effect. To demonstrate just how fast these tablets break down, let's go back to our whole tablets. 
The light's already coming on. In just a short time, our tablets will break down, even in cold water, which proves electrically that our tablets are the most powerful mineral products available. Another way of illustrating that our products are very best is with a hydrometer. Basically, a hydrometer is a calibrated float and measures the weight of liquids. A hydrometer measures specific gravity, or in this case, measures the relative amount of minerals dissolved completely to their smallest ionic structure. This breakdown must occur for minerals to be absorbed or to conduct electricity. This is the same principle as why you float and can't sink in the Great Salt Lake. It is also why our products are superior. On this particular hydrometer scale, distilled water measures at zero. You can add minerals in the form of rocks or coins and it wouldn't move off zero because they're not soluble. Here are a number of mineral tablets, all measuring at zero, showing little solubility. Here are a number of mineral waters. Note, some of these are pretty good. Some of these measuring as high as seven. It's well to note, however, that this particular product lists aluminum on the label as MC, or major constituent. But now let's try our liquid trace minerals. It goes completely off the scale. Figured mathematically, it shows over 26 times more concentrated than the next liquid trace mineral product we're aware of. Now that's quite a difference, which proves again that our products are the very best.